Given the increasing rate environment, what are the ramifications of moving away from a close to zero interest rate policy? So what do you do now that the interest rate environment is changing? Well, there's no question about the fact that as the interest rates have gone up, it's, it's hostile to stock prices. But they should go up. We couldn't have kept them forever at zero. And I just think it's just one more damn thing to adapt to in investment life is that there are, there are headwinds and there are tailwinds. And one of the headwinds is inflation. And I think more inflation over the next 100 years is inevitable with, given the nature of democratic politics, politics in a democracy. So I think we'll have more inflation. That's one of the reasons the Daily Journal owns securities instead of government bonds, owns common stocks instead of government <coughs> bonds. When you say the nature of democratic policies, and I, I forget exactly how you worded it, are you talking about the Democratic Party? Or are you talking about democracy as a no, whole? No, no, I'm talking to? about uh, Trump ran a deficit that was bigger than the Democrats did. All Democratic, all politicians in a democracy tend to be in favor of printing the money and spending it. And that will cause some inflation over time. It may avoid a few recessions, too. It may not be all bad, but it, it, it will do more harm than good, I think, from this point forward.